Hi, boys and girls. Welcome to Storytime. So glad you could join us. Come on in and sit down on the rug with your friends. story time at a dairy farm and we're going to read Tales of the Dairy Godmother which is written by Viola Butler. This specific story is called Chuck's Ice Cream Wish and it's been illustrated by Ward Jenkins. This book is published by Feeding Minds Press. Feeding Minds Press have given us permission to read this book and if you go to their website which will be in the notes below then you'll be able to find out about lots of other books that they publish and other resources for learning more about dairy and other great foods. Chucky, did you take out the trash yet? Yeah, last week. Charles, no chores. No ice cream. Aww. I wish I had all the ice cream I could ever eat. <sighs> ah, a bug. Where? Hey, do you have wings? And let's start over. Chuck. I'm your dairy godmother, and I'm here to make your dairy dream come moo. Uh, I mean, true. Wait, what? You mean you're going to, to grant your dairy wish? Yes, I am. Wow, cows. Cows are awesome, but, uh, Where's the ice cream? Cow's milk is where ice cream begins. Stick with me, Chuck, and your reward will be sweet and creamy. Okay, I guess. Delicious. Let's go. First, we clean the cows. Then we hook them up to these tubes. This machine does the milking for us. Wait, where's all that milk going? This seems like a big chore. Milk's flowing into these storage tanks. They'll keep it cold so it doesn't go bad. Okay, so is it ice cream time yet? Not yet. Now we need to wash the floor. Oh, wash the floor? Who am I? Cinderella? Poof. Ha ha, very funny. It's all clean. Now, ice cream. Not yet. Now we have to test the milk. Test? It's just milk. How can it study? Not that kind of test. To make sure it's healthy, we test the milk for different things, like its temperature. What if it fails? We throw it away. Throw it away? But all that work! Don't worry, this batch of milk is perfect. Phew. Uh, let's celebrate with ice. Not yet. Now it's time to check on the cows. But what about ice cream? Great milk for yummy ice cream comes from healthy cows. Help me check their food and water. What's this weird stuff? That's their food. Cows eat things like grass and grains. 
Farmers, nutritionists and veterinarians make sure their cows eat a healthy diet. All this eating's making me hungry. Isn't it ice cream time yet? Not yet, but almost. Just one more chore. Take this shovel. Really? What are we shoveling? Cow pies. Poop? Yuck. That's it. This isn't ice cream. This is work. I didn't wish for chores. I wished for ice cream. Chuck, you wished for all the ice cream you could ever eat, right? No better way to see where ice cream comes from than to do everything a dairy farmer does. Phew, I think I need a nap. What's that noise? A calf. Maggie's a new mom. Giving birth to a calf means she'll begin to make milk. Oh, I guess cows really do need us to take care of them. And if we get ice cream out of it, that's like sprinkles on the top. Exactly, Chuck. Now follow me. We have one more thing to scoop. Oh no. You worked hard, Chuck, and you've earned this. Ice cream, yum! May I have more? This is the best I've ever tasted. Not yet, first we've got to milk the cows. What? But we did that already. Cows need to be milked two or three times a day, every day, even on weekends and holidays. Later. Wow. Making ice cream is a lot of work. It certainly is. But this ice cream tastes so good. I think it's extra delicious because I helped make it. You know what, Chuck? I think you're going to make a dairy good farmer. What are you doing, Chucky? I'm taking out the trash. Mom, if you know how many chores went into making ice cream, Trust me, this is nothing. The end. If you want to have a go at making ice cream, then at the back of the book, there's a recipe. And you can have a go at home. We're going to have a try now.